Hey, good people. Welcome back to Beauty in the Frizz. My name is Kara. Whether you're new or returning, thank you so much for stopping by and hanging out with me for another mocktails and makeup. Still dry January going on down here and the Ravens are playing today and you know, we're going to have... <clears throat> Hmm. Oh, well, when they see this, it's going to be Sunday. So I'll have me a little mocktail or something like that and hope for a great win. But today we are going to be playing with the Sephora Favorites Perfect Pout Lip Kit. We're going to try on all the lipsticks. The boys are going to pick out the ones that I'm going to try, like in the order. <clears throat> and we're going to figure out if it's worth the value. So if that sounds good to you, keep watching this video. Let me know what you think. And if makeup is your therapy and your love, if it makes you happy and you want to hang out with someone that feels the same way, definitely consider joining the community. I'd love to have you back. All right, let's get started. So how are you? I'm, I'm okay. Yesterday I wanted to film and hmm, just wasn't in the right mind frame, but I'm feeling a lot better this morning. So I'm excited to go ahead and talk about this Sephora Favorites lip kit. So Sephora comes out with these favorites all the time and they don't really catch my eye at all, but this one did. This one is $34 and it includes three full size lipsticks. So on the back of the package, it says, create your new signature pout. This extra juicy set includes five gorgeous lip products, three full size and two deluxe. Assorted with a mix of balms, lipsticks and lip liners, this set is curated with everything you need to keep your lips hydrated and lush this spring. So you see that this is definitely geared toward those juicy spring releases, but we do have a matte lipstick in here, actually a couple matte lipsticks that are very comfortable. So I figured, why don't we give it a try? I think what really attracted me to this was that I just bought two lipsticks from Charlotte Tilbury and the lipsticks are $35. So to get all of these for $34, I think is a great value. It actually says that this has a $90 US value. So we're going to look at the lipsticks that come in here and then I'm gonna demo them all for you. And then I will be back at the end to let you know what I think about this Perfect Pout Lip Kit. First in the kit, we have the Charlotte Tilbury Matte Revolution Lipstick in Pillow Talk Medium. And this is one of the full size products. Next, we have the Clarins Lip Comfort Oil in the shade Pattaya. I have been wanting to try the Clarins Lip Oil for some time, so that definitely attracted me to this set. From Glossier, we have the Ultra Lip in the shade Villa. From Rare Beauty, we have the Kind Words Matte Lipstick in the shade Humble, which is another full size. And from Tarte, we have the Maracuja Juicy Lip Plump, that is the deluxe size, in the shade Honeysuckle. And the Clarins is a deluxe size as well. All right, so now that you have seen the five lip products and the swatches, we are going to get to some earlier me's where you're going to see me try on these lip products throughout the week. And I'll let you know how I'm feeling about them. I'll be back at the end to go ahead and wrap it up. Hold on, make sure my mic is on. My mic sounds nice. Check one. All right. Hey guys, so no makeup on right now. I'm actually about to get on my bike because I am back in business with my cardio. So I just figured why not look cute or halfway for this video or the workout. So August is going to pick my lipstick. August picks my lipstick. <laughs> All right, here he comes. So at this point, you've already seen what's in the Sephora favorites kit. This is actually my first time opening it. Okay, August, we have five choices. Is this a resealable pack? It is. It is a nice resealable pack. Who knew? All right, August, come on. Which one do you want to pick? We got five great choices. We don't seem interested. Now, here's the thing. I want you to think about this because I'm about to I'm about to work out. So I need you to think about which one you think would look the best. So come here. Now my lips are pale. Look at them. They look almost white. Okay. 
So these are the lipsticks. Let me show you the colors. So we have this beautiful. Mm, no. No. He says no to Rare Beauty. This is Glossier. This is a nice little bomb okay. here. Charlotte Tilbury, darling. Is this Walk of No Shame? Oh no, because I'm about to be mad. Because I'm like, I have Walk of No Shame. Okay. For workout. Okay, let's see the other ones though. Well, I just, you never All right, it's okay. I'm, I told nobody to go on my bike. Now, this is a nice lip oil. This is just really nice and hydrating. You might have a little color to your lips. All right. And then lastly, we have this one. Now, this is... I can't see. Yes! So, so which one do you want to pick? Um, what, is the what one? was the other one? This is the one. Between Char and yeah. Tarte. Okay, so yeah. let's look at them both and see. So these are the choices yeah. for, no, I'm not putting them both on right now. Don't mess up the bullet. We're gonna only pick one, because we have to do all five of them. So here, which one do you, but I'm not putting them all on now. I'm only putting, okay, August wants to swatch. So now that you've done this, you have to be down to do this the whole video. Hold on, hold on, you have to show them. All right, now let's look it up close. I think I'm gonna do this. All right, well you've already committed. I need to wash no, you have to. Well, why you wash it off? Tell me which one you like. <laughs> like that one. The juicy, the juicy one. No, I don't like that one. This one. This is a fail. This is a fail. So we're working out in Charlotte Tilbury, darling. The Matte Revolution Pillow Talk Medium. August, this was your choice for the workout. I'm going to. Well, this is for the cardio part. I'm gonna do some like weights, but then we also I have to like order groceries. Work. This is this no, is the one. I don't like. Those aren't part of the Where's choices. The juicy one? I don't like that one. Well, I'm putting on the one you wanted. Ugh. Let me zoom in because now this is too much. All right, so just imagine like my hair all the way untwisted and being <laughs> cute at the gym without the yellow rubber bands on my braces. Just ignore those. This is a cute color. <laughs> this is great because you know I'm thinking about buying the new Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks and I may already have done so when you see this video. I need to wax like right here. I'll do it later. NRN. NRN darling. And I end. That's how Shar would say it. And I end, darling. Can wait. You know what? I know people. It gets on people's nerves, like the whole pillow talk thing. But she was onto something with that, like because pillow talk is its own color. Like, do any other brands have their own color? Because when I think of pillow talk, I don't just think like <gasps> any pink. It's like a certain pink. So, I think her new lipsticks are going to be. Some of them are going to be in the matte formula. The red ones, maybe. And the other ones in the kissing formula. We'll see. I don't know. I'm just talking. All right. What do we think? What do we think? Do we like? I like this. And it feels pretty good. It feels perfect for a ride on my Peloton. So I am going to get into that. And then after I get off, maybe we'll change and do something. I don't know why I'm doing that with my hair. But my hair. <laughs> so what I'm trying to do, I didn't twist my hair last night. So I was just trying to have some defined curls here. So I just twisted a few throughout. But now that I'm getting on the bike, I was like, I'm not gonna take the curls out. Maybe I'll do it later. Maybe I won't. Maybe we'll do something like this for the bike ride. That's right here indoors, right here. It's not like it's you know, anyone seeing me, but I gotta get back on it. The scale is going down y'all. The scale is going down. Cause I started, you know, really getting serious and I was 163 and now it's at 159. I'm gonna check real quick before I get on the bike for accuracy. Cause I don't, I'm not trying to weigh myself every day, but all right, y'all cute for the bike ride. I will be back. Let me know what you think about lipstick number one. Hey y'all, I just got off the bike. I did like a 50 minute ride and was watching Basketball Wives and I was going to just sit there and finish it, but then it cut off. So I just wanted to give a little initial thought about this Charlotte Tilbury a matte revolution. I think it's nice. I don't think it's a standout lipstick formula, but it's a nice matte. Like when I rub my lips, there's still like some moisture there and comfortable. There's no, like it doesn't look dry. You know, I have natural lines on my lips, but 
it's not making me have cracky lips or anything like that and I do have some redness here and I was working out so that's not the lipstick but I just wanted to pop back on here and let you know how I am feeling about it I think it's nice but I think that why I'm having a hard time uh, articulating how I feel about it is because lately I have been into the juicy hydrated lips and it's also winter time so i'm thinking that's why i'm not like oh my gosh this is great i was thinking how would this compare to alisa eldridge or gucci or dior lipstick because i wear all of those but all the lipsticks that i have that are matte i think are really great formulas and i would put this with them overall i think it's nice just right now i'm into more satin juicy hydrated lips so i still think i'm going to get one or two of her new ones that are coming out but i think i want the satiny formula just just i'm into the juice right now juicy lips i like matte lips but i'm into the juicy ones so those are my thoughts on the charlotte tilbury this is matte revolution pillow talk medium and i will try to get august in here because now he's like oh why did i want to do this i'm like you always ask to be in videos and now i have something for you to do and now you don't want to do it but he's gonna pick the next one him or marky so i'll be back Hey friends. Hi. So Marky's gonna be picking lipstick number two. Okay, Marky, let me show you what we have to choose from. Swallow, here we go. We got four left. Which one do you think you want? Come over, let me show you the colors. We've got, you didn't even see the colors. Get down, I can't see you, sit right here. All right, we got this one here. I'm showing you the colors. What color is that? Pink. Okay, well there it is, yeah. This is a, like a lip oil. We all it's a lot of vanilla. Um, it doesn't smell like vanilla, but smell it. What does it smell like? Blueberry. Yeah, kind of like blueberry. Then we have this one here. This is a, another pink one. Yes. And then the last one I have is really juicy. It's like a berry shade. Yes. Which one do you think you want me to put on? Because he said lipstick makes your mouth beautiful. Isn't that what she said? The juicy one? Yes. The dark one? This one? All right. Thanks. Wait, don't leave. You're going to have to tell me what it looks like. You want to fruit punch? That one didn't smell like fruit punch. The other, you want, don't want me to put on the one that smells like fruit punch, or you want me to put on this one? Yeah, this yeah. one doesn't smell like anything. The only one that mm, smells. It smells like chocolate. Marky, okay, I didn't smell chocolate, but okay. So Marky picked the Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip Plump. Don't leave because you need to know if, what you think it looks Not like. For dinner today. I don't know for dinner. I was thinking about lasagna. What do you think about that? Oh, yes, he's saying yes, okay. No. I'll make y'all a lasagna. Mm-hmm. I'll have to try some cheese. Mm, this is so juicy. Okay, this reminds me a little bit of the Charlotte Tilbury lipstick lip gloss that I like to wear. Wow, whoa. This is hydrating. So this is that juicy one right here. That's ooh. okay. Now I feel now here's what I think about this initially. Wait, first, let me show it to y'all. Let's show it to Marky. Wow, what do you think? Wait a minute, say. Marky, what are your thoughts? Right here, y'all look. Wow, that's a beautiful. Well, thank you, Marky. Okay, you go about your business. I know you're not really trying to be in here, Marky. Thank you for helping. Wow, it's so beautiful. I know, because Mark can be so monotone, but I know, like, he, he means it. Okay. Mama. Yes? Because I said that wasn't yours and it didn't work. Marky took the other one. I didn't get on my nerves with these chargers. This has tingle in it. It's very, very juicy. My concern with this is how much I use. You don't need a lot, and I just was doing my thing. So now, look how much is gone. Look at it. That's ridiculous. I'll probably just do. Oh my gosh, it's mm, yeah. I, you might as well just do this with this one. I don't even have to come back for a final thought on this one because I like it. I like how it feels. It's very juicy. 
is going to get over everything. So, you know, you just don't need too much. And you probably just, you don't want to put this on if you're going to be doing a lot. Because you're going to have to reapply this. But then when you reapply it, you just only need a little bit. So I definitely put on way too much and used a lot of product. I like the tint of it. It's really not deep at all. And it feels nice. The plumping's not anything extreme. But I just don't need that. I don't need... Oh, it is a lip plump. So there you go. So I guess if I feel like I need that. I personally don't need a lip plump. Because half the time, I forget to close my mouth. So it just it ends up looking wild. So I don't really... I probably wouldn't purchase that. However, the value, I, I'm standing by that the value of this is great because I am going to use them. I'll use them. I'll finish them, but I'm not going to be going at length to repurchase, I don't think. What all is it talking about? All right, we'll be back with the next one. I forgot to tell y'all because I'm putting my lipstick on for different events. I'm putting this lipstick on to go get ready to set up my report cards. I don't know if I'm doing them yet, but I'm gonna set up my workstation and get some kombucha. That is my plan for this lipstick. So I'll, I'll be back. All right, we getting ready to pick a lipstick for work, y'all. Boys, where's my coffee? I don't drink coffee, that's from a movie. Have y'all ever seen the Chipmunks Excellent Adventure? Chipmunks Amazing Adventure is like really old. She'd be like, Klaus. Where's my coffee? I'm not doing eyeshadow today. I'm just doing bronzer. Got the Chanel Healthy Glow on. And we got the boys. And we got the boys. So we have three lipsticks and then we're gonna go because I have a meeting. I feel like this looks cute. Mm, yeah. All right, y'all. We have Rare Beauty. Okay. They're like, yeah. <laughs> Number two, hold on, we have a lip oil, which is very gorgeous. Wow. Shiny no, and juicy. No. Let me show you the rare beauty. Number uh, No. Okay, and then num Okay. And then number three, we have oh, this is a nice color. The Glossier. Ooh, okay, which one do y'all want? Mm, no, definitely not that one. Which one? That pick one. the shade that y'all like the most. I want. The glitter and the this, glitter. This, this one. one the this lip one. oil. Oh, this one. All right, let's go with oh, this one, Marky. This one and the, the pink one and this one. But you have to pick one. I can only. I'm only gonna put on one because I want them to. The one in the middle. Yeah. Marky, which one do you like? Okay. The pink one. Yeah. They are going with Rare Beauty today, y'all. And I. Hmm. I wonder if I need a liner with this. Well, that's the point of this video. So I'm put this on and we about to roll. Oh, my lips so ashy. Mm. Now, I, I do like her lipsticks, though. I will say that. It's just um, this particular color, I think we need a little bit of lineage. And I don't know if I have anything available. We're about to use this. This might mess it up, y'all. We're about to go. We are. Oh, my gosh, I have toothpaste. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all, if I have toothpaste. Oh, my lips. Toothpaste? Mm-hmm. This shade is called Humble. Yeah. You know what it means to be humble? No. Okay, we gotta talk it's about that. Crumble. Oh, uh, okay. Crumble. 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 Okay, that's a lot. This might give me a little problem here, y'all, because you see that line? No. See that? What you see? That's gonna drive me nuts. I love this color, but. That's that's the issue with the lipstick for me, cause see that, cause my lip it won't stand there, so that's the issue that I'm, I have with this one. But as far as the formula, I have one. I think it's Wise that I really love. So, all right, we're going to get to work, y'all. And where's my phone so we can take the selfie with the picture? I really don't. I'm gonna know. I'm gonna um ping it. It's right here. All right, hurry what up. are you doing? We gotta take our picture with the. Seven twenty. I know, but we have to take our picture with the it's lipstick on, so people can see what it looks like. It's not seven twenty six. I knew it. No, I said yes. How do you know? What? It's seven sixteen. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh. oh my God, my. Oh my God. Oh my God. There ain't no way. Ain't no way. Turn this off. All right, here we go. Oh, heard no. We're doing peace signs. What are we doing? One. 
two. Wait a minute, I'm not even in it. One, two. Ba, ba, boo, oh, you're covering Marky. One, ba, ba, boo, two, three. Um, there's our selfie with the picture. All right, going to work. See, yes, we'll see y'all later for lipstick number four, which will be for working out. Maybe I'll probably be by myself for that one, and then we'll have one more left. So, see y'all. Say bye. Uh, hey friends, if I look a little disheveled, it's because I'm just back from work. And now I am going to be going to the bus stop in two minutes to get Marky. So I figured why not try another lip? So we have two left. Yes. And I'm going to be choosing because August says he doesn't want to because he's in a mood with me because I won't take him to get the pillow slippers that we talked about. I never said I, I never had a date. So we have, two, no, we have two left. Where's the lip oil? Uh, well, I guess I know which one I'm gonna be using because the lip oil is not available. Huh, well that's, what if, it would be just like me to lose one of these lipsticks, but it's probably sitting on this desk. All right, so we're going with the Glossier, is it Glossier, right? Ultra Lip. This is my first time trying the brand, so. Let's get this on. Now, my thoughts on the Rare Beauty, I don't think I like that shade for me. So, I do like those kind of foundation shades. But in here, I'm trying to think, what color is mine? I just don't think it was going to, I was going to be self-conscious. That's what I'll say. Now, this is called Villa. So, let's zoom in. And then, I'm going to go pick Marky up. And then, we'll have the lip oil. And I could put that on for my workout. Ew. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, this is mm -hmm, right up my street, as Charlotte Holcroft would say. Mm, 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 mm. Well, I like this. What time is it? 4.10. See, and I was doing all this with the Juicy Maracuja and use it, I use, <laughs> mm. So this is reminding me, well, first of all, this is perfect, perfect shade perfect um, nude for a lot of people not all people but a lot i'm here for this one what's wrong hey august what's wrong did you have a bad day you had a bad day um, i want we may i won't give them to you um, I didn't it. you did you said i won't give you your slippers you know what you have a santa happened to bring you a nice pair of slippers with a matching robe and you and Marky don't even wear those robes. I'm not like that. I'm not like that mom. You're not like what? I don't wear robes. You do mm, rude self, little grumpa lump. Anyway y'all, mm, this is my favorite of the bunch. So just so you know, right now, I am going to go out and about in the streets around the corner and get Marky from the bus stop. And then at some point I'll be back to try on the lip oil once it's found and wrap it up. All right. All right, I am back to try on the lip oil. I found it, it was on my dresser by the door. I'm not sure why. Anyway, y'all, this is it, this is it. So is this, yes, this is the one that smells good. I'm excited. I've always seen this at Sephora and I'm about to work out. I am about to get on my Peloton and finish watching Basketball Wives Reunion. It's going to be a chill workout, but I'm still, you know, get my heart rate up, get out of the saddle, you know. Mmm. Yes to this. Oh, I love the. Mmm. Let me know. I always see the Clarence lip oil. I think I just said that. Oh my gosh, yes. This is a yes, and I love how it smells. Mm, it's a fruity smell. It smells really good. It doesn't have a taste though, which is great. So, well, I don't mind that either, but whatever. Okay, Guys, I hope that you enjoyed the demo of these lipsticks. I realized that earlier this week, I did my final thoughts. So, I'm going to go back to the earlier me, and you're going to see me rank these. And, um... Let me see how I'm thinking about them right now, actually. And then we'll see, because <laughs> I have been wearing them. Let me see, look at these again. Then we'll then we'll get back to the, to the old me. I think my favorite is gonna be the Ultra Lip. I really like that. 
And then the Charlotte Tilbury, I think was great in the lip oil. I think those three are my favorites in this bunch. The Rare Beauty, oops. The Rare Beauty, I really do like. I just didn't like the shade. So I'm sure I'll talk about that. And then the Maracuja, although I like it, it's, it's kind of thick, kind of sticky, and I think it's going to go real fast. So let's see uh, what the earlier this week me says about these products. And uh, I'm going to see y'all okay. later. I have tried on all five. So let's rank them. I think if I had to rank these, number one would be the Glossier Ultra Lip. This really reminded me of, as I was saying, my Chanel Rouge Allure. I think those are the ones. They're a regular lipstick bullet, but the formula is like a bomb. It's very thick. And I really like that. This is the same like kind of type of lipstick as the Dior Lip Shines. I wore Dior Bar after I took off the Rare Beauty because I just really wasn't feeling it. It reminds me of that as well. Just very thick and hydrating. I think this has to be my first choice. My second choice is definitely going to be the Clarins Lip Oil. I really love the texture of this. I'm in the consistency. I love that it's not sticky. I have nice juicy lips. It has a really, really slight tint. Like you're not even really gonna see that even on my pale lips. But I could see myself getting one of these in full size. I actually had looked at it before, but NRN, not right now because I have all these nice lipsticks to play with. In third place, I don't know. It's either gonna be the Charlotte Tilbury or the Tarte. I want to say Tarte would be in third place because I'm just not in the mood for the matte right now. What I don't like about this is I just feel like I'm using so much. Like it's a really nice formula and let's say you get, you know, you get a nice amount in the, in here, but I just feel like it's, oh, it's super soft. And I like that, but I think it's going to go quickly. So, oh, also the plump, oh, I don't mess this up. Now I'm distracted because, oh, well, here's another thing. If you put it up too far, it doesn't wind back down. I just had to push it down and it did it with ease because it's so soft. Okay. That's not third place. I want to go with Char for third place because I really like the color. I think the formula is nice. I'm just not, oh wait, back up, back up. The plumping, the plumping tingle. I don't like that. I don't want that. I don't need that. That's another reason why this is in fourth place. So let's go back to third. This lipstick by Charlotte Tilbury is very nice. I am just not in the matte lipstick mood right now. I've been wanting juicy lips, but as far as a matte formula, I can see myself wearing this. It's soft. Your lips feel kind of like powdery but they're not cracked like if you or dry like if you rub your lips together you're not going to have any friction there so even though this is matte i don't think this will dry your lips out so let me know your thoughts on that i am new to her matte formula told you about fourth place was tart and number five is going to be rare beauty but not because it's not a good lipstick formula you know what let's move this up Rare Beauty is gonna come in fourth place because the color, I mean, I can do this color. I'm just gonna put something else with it so that this like area here gracefully goes into the lipstick color because the lipstick color is really beautiful. I also like this nice creamy formula and this is a matte, yeah, matte lipstick. Couldn't remember, but yeah, matte. So it's another comfortable matte lipstick formula. It's just not my favorite color choice, but everything else about it is fine. So I don't even know why I was about to say that. Number five is gonna have to be Tarte. Tarte doesn't move from three to five because the more I think about it, the more I don't like this menthol feel on my lips. And I don't need the plumping, so it's nothing I need to, I mean, not suffer through, that's very dramatic, but I, I just, it's okay. I just find myself wasting a lot of the product. I think that's what I would do. As far as the actual bomb inside or lip plump, that actually feels nice. 
it's a little messy as I was saying, but you're not really putting your fingers on it. But if you put it up too high, you can't get it back down. <laughs> yeah, you can't get it back down. You gotta push it down yourself. I did not use this much, but I did, I did use it because it's soft. With this one, a little goes a long way if you want this one to last. Overall, and I don't get these kits very often. Do I think the value is worth it? Absolutely. I did not film the intro yet, so I'm not sure what I said, but I, if I did say something, I probably would have mentioned the fact that the Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks that are coming out tomorrow are $35 a piece. And when you see this video, the lipsticks are already out and I may have gotten one or two, but anyway, that's not why we're here. $35 a piece. So you're talking about $34 and you get three full sized uh, lip products. I think the Rare Beauty is in the $20 mark and the Glossier probably something like that. And then, I mean, if this is a mini, I don't know. I just feel like you're gonna waste that if you get it. I know the Clarins is bigger, but yeah, I think this is a great value. If this comes back in stock or you can get it same day delivery because that's all I've seen right now, it's not online because I did get the same day delivered when I ordered something else. I think it was the Huda Beauty stuff. I would get my hands on it if you're interested in like trying various brands of lipsticks and you wanna do it for a reasonable price because these lip products, all this makeup is so expensive now to get three of these full size lipsticks for $34. I don't think you could beat that. And then you get the other two minis. So definitely worth it in my book and i'll continue to look out for these and you know they have sephora favorites for different things they have perfume ones cologne they have like a fresh face set clean beauty set they have all kinds they have the mascara one as well so it's worth taking a look and just seeing from time to time this just popped up as new and i was kept looking at it like Mm, this looks pretty good. So I'm glad I tried it out and I'll continue to use these products in my collection. Let me know if you purchased this one or if you've purchased any recently and what you think about the value. Thank you so much for taking out some of your time and hanging out with me for another one today. I hope this was therapy for you. It always is for me. And until I see you again, make sure you are being gentle with yourself. Talk to yourself nice, stay safe, and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye. Go block your ears.